the skin, the smile. <laughs> love that. I love this hat. Hat looks amazing on me. Chrome hearts. But that light, that beautiful light is shining bright on Mr. Wonderful. Just like how I share that light upon you beautiful people out there. The fellas and those beautiful ladies. Oh, ladies. I know you're looking so damn beautiful because you know what? You're wearing those beautiful costumes to those Halloween parties. And I know. Trust me. I know. I see a lot of them. Once again, we are doing this a remix to the sneaker profiles that I did last year on some Halloween colored Halloween theme shoes. And this one right here to my right. Oh, a work of fucking art when it comes to a Halloween theme shoe. I want to say it's almost a perfect shoe. And it's almost my favorite shoe when it comes to Halloween. But there's still one more just above it. But it's still, it's a very close second. And it's just an amazing, amazing shoe. But we'll get we'll get into it. So you must be asking yourself, Mr. Wonder, what happened to the new profiles, the new shoes? Well, since we we're pretty damn close to Halloween, right? Since we're just, Halloween is literally right around the corner. I wanted to bring back that light that I gave last year on some Halloween shoes. I wanted to bring that light back on him again. Because you know what? When it comes to Halloween themed shoes, it's really just like you can only get your wares out of them during the month of October. Or even some on just like whenever you can take them out for the month of October. So it's not an everyday wear. It's not an every other. It's not an every month wear either. You can only really bring out Halloween theme shoes on Halloween or on in the month of October. So that's why a lot of light never really gets shined throughout the entire year. And it serves it right. And the most light that it gets is during Halloween. So that's why I didn't want you people out there, the fellas and the beautiful ladies, to forget about these shoes. I wanted you to remember them, especially with Halloween just right there. Of course, October brings amazing things when it comes to the month, right? We get Halloween at the very end of the month, which is amazing. You know, the ladies, the ladies are always looking so damn amazing, dress the way they dress, and they get away with it because it is Halloween. We have playoff baseball. We got football. We got the NBA season has officially started. The weather's starting to cool down, thank God. We had Mr. Wonderful's birthday at the beginning of October, October 6th to be exact. So there's just a lot of amazing things going on in October. I remember we used to gain an hour of sleep in October. Now they want it because October was just filled with greatness. They wanted to give November that. So I'll let I'll let November have that. But great time. Great time. A great month for all the October babies out there. Shout out to each and every single one of you. Mr. Wonderful is wearing that G-Shock though. That NASA collaboration. Great watch. A black Lulu. Fundamental T, as you can see, the tries, the chrome heart hat, the Miami edition one. I love this hat. The rag and, blue, rag and bone blue denim looks amazing. But you see that, the Miami hit. Just a great fit. I'm relaxing at home. I just wanted to drop these quick profile remixes for you beautiful people so you cannot forget about these great Halloween shoes. And, of course, you're going to be all over this one because it is an SB, and it is a very salt after sb because it's just it's just an amazing shoe like i said it's a very close it's a close second when it comes to the one that i'm going to be presenting to you in a day but let's take a look at this one though you do have that all aqua box right the aqua and white box but i don't want you to focus on that i don't even want you to focus on the tissue paper because you did not get the standard tissue paper when it came to this one i did pick this up on stock x <laughs> and i paid it pennies for this one but this is what i want you to pay attention to right there the nike sb dunk low pro black total orange size 10 and a half right there beautiful 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 right there the 10 and a half it never gets any better than that but here we go remember this was a past sneaker profiles from last year this was actually sneaker profile 89 but this is gonna be sneaker profile remix right here the nike dunk sb night of mischief 
How many people out there have this shoe? I mean, tell me. Drop a comment down below right now. Let me know if you have this shoe. If you have it, have you worn it? If you haven't, why? Because <laughs> I haven't worn it and I don't think I'll ever wear, wear this one. This is just a beautiful shoe. So right here, this shoe was released back on October 19th, 2019. Okay, so we're looking at a lot different. So we had the first one I hit you with, the sneaker profile remix was the Air Jordan 1 Starfish. Beautiful colorway, orange, that cream color, and the black. A shoe that you can definitely wear during October, the entire month of October. A shoe that you can definitely wear even until November because of those autumn colors. Then I hit you with the Nike Dunk Halloween, the glow in the dark. That shoe was released actually in April of like 2021 or 2022. Not during October. So April, which is crazy time, right? To release in the Halloween shoe. But I still give them credit though for doing that because at least you have the shoe come October. Rather than releasing a shoe in October, which makes sense, but you don't get the shoe until maybe the very end of October and you literally have one time, one wear out of it. And then I hit you with the Nike Air Trainer 3 Dracula. And that was actually released in October, which was a good time. It makes sense. But if you really think about it, it takes a little bit for you to get it if you get it on the sneaker app. So you may miss, you miss, you may miss Halloween to wear that shoe. Then you have to wait an entire year to wear it. So here we go. This one, though, was released on October 19th, 2019. Okay, so if you got it at a skate shop, good for you. Perfect, right? You can wear it during the month of, you know, a good, uh, maybe a couple times in the month of October. But if you got it on the sneaker app, you're going to have to wait. And then you're pretty, you're really pushing it when it comes to wearing it for Halloween or yeah, you're trying to get your wares in during the month of October because you're not really working with a lot of days. This one was an, it says a $90 retail price tag. I don't know about that. That seems really low, but who knows? Maybe that was the case. But let's go ahead and go into this beautiful shoe. Remember, this is the Night of Mischief, so I want you to think of that. You do got this beautiful orange tumble leather toe box. This nice rough suede when it comes to the toe box and then going up towards the shoelaces. And pretty much that same rough suede throughout the shoe though, now that I look at it. You got it on this side panel, but you do have this beautiful purple stitching representing the spider's web right there. This nice orange tumble leather swoosh. This black rough suede, of course, that goes throughout the entire shoe. You do got a nice spider embossed sewn into the shoe and then you have a little bit of purple cobweb so nice touch that black midsole with the black stitching and then you have this nice lime green outsole but it does glow in the dark so a cool touch on that so on the what left shoe it does say trick in the back but on the right shoe it does have treat so that's a pretty cool thing about the left and the right did a little bit of difference going on there this is in that all black suede, right? The rough suede. Nothing smooth about the suede. The black midsole with the black stitching and that lime green outsole that glows in the dark. Medial side. So we're kind of looking a little bit different. Nothing too crazy, but it is different, right? We are missing the spider swoosh on the medial side, but besides that, pretty identical. Orange tumble leather swoosh. All black suede that goes throughout the entire... Sh yeah, goes throughout the entire shoe even the side panel typically we see a difference going on there but on the side panel you do have this purple stitching for the cobweb you do have this nice black rough suede going through the shoelaces and then also going towards the front part of the shoe the all blacked out midsole with the black stitching and then that nice lime green glow in the dark outsole here we go outsole right there all lime green except the middle part that is orange and let's take a look at the aerial, aerial view of the shoe, which is really cool. My favorite part, like I always say. So right here, on the toe box, you have the jack-o'-lantern face that you need to cut out, right? When you, when you first make um, a face on a pumpkin, you always have to put those little dots going into them. 
and then that's when you do the cutout so that's basically what it's giving you but you see the two eyes and in the mouth with the two fangs you have the orange laces you do got the black tongue and I love that that slimed out Nike with the swoosh and the SB I love that hit room definitely reminds me of the show double dare all purple collar when it comes to the to the um, inner part of the ankle support I love that though you see the guts of the pumpkin on the insole and you do have that slimed out Nike on the insole in that lime green and then you also have that zoom air a nice touch though on on the shoelaces which I really like are these candy corn tips when it comes to the shoelaces and then I love this part right here you do have a little ghost a little bit of childish a childlike ghost right here but definitely is still a little cool hit though but the ghost on the inner part of the tongue or behind the tongue I should say cool shoe I love this shoe great shoe very well put together like I said if I didn't have the other one this would probably be my favorite Halloween shoe but I do have the the other one that makes it is just barely above this one but still a great shoe a lot of great things going on in the shoe if you know if you really look at it you're like wow a lot of great details and I really love how they did everything and I'm, I'm really happy that I picked this one up at the right time because I literally paid in very little money to, for on this one I'm not sure the resale market is now but I'm sure it's probably up there especially now since we're in the month of October I'm sure it really shot up but we are what three days closer to Halloween my favorite holiday the women oh the women are getting dressed up as normal when it comes to the Halloween parties which I love fucking amazing I appreciate each and every single one of you for joining me on into the FC sneaker factory and doing another sneaker profile remix on another classic right here another classic Halloween shoe right here classic Halloween theme shoe to be exact I appreciate those that tune in the fellas out there and those beautiful ladies we just have one more to go and you'll be seeing that tomorrow as you can see content after content when it comes to these Halloween drops because I'm trying to get them all in before Halloween is literally right there so tune in next time I would appreciate that thank you so much from the cold heart of Mr. Wonderful and all those beautiful ladies oh I send my beautiful shout out to each and every single one of you make sure you DM, DM me those Halloween pictures of you out there at those Halloween parties I would really appreciate that thank you so much and like how all the women always tell me whenever I'm around them even now even recently because I'm I'm a, around a ton of them because of all the Halloween parties that I'm going to Floyd Mr. Wonderful and this these are the words that I hear Floyd you are too god damn